What is DeFi? DeFi stands for Decentralized Finance. Decentralized Finance is a permissionless system for trading money and risk on the internet. Decentralized Finance institutions are generally called protocols. Protocols enable the exchange of money, loans, tokens and investments without middlemen. How does it accomplish this? Let's break this down and explain how finance and decentralization can come together to create something with very exciting possibilities. So first of all, what is finance? Finance is defined as the transmission of money and risk. Banks are a great example. In exchange for giving a borrower a mortgage, they accept the credit risk of the individual. They exchange money now, which is the mortgage principal, in exchange for risk, which is future interest rate payments. Looking closely at the word risk, risk is defined in financial terms as the chance that an investment's actual gains will differ from an expected outcome or return. Risk includes the possibility of losing some or all of an original investment. Decentralized means DeFi reduces reliance on trusted third parties such as banks. Instead, decentralized finance is built on top of smart contract blockchains. Blockchains follow publicly published rules and store redundant data so there is no possibility of double spending money. In DeFi, transactions generally occur between individual users and pools of investors. The pools of investors will function in some way like a financial entity, enabling trading or loans to occur. DeFi is also permissionless. Permissionless means there are no barriers to entry built into the system. There is an equal treatment of everyone on the blockchain, as identity does not matter. While it is permissionless, it comes with transaction costs. Blockchains collect fees to process transactions, and DeFi protocols also collect fees for their services. Why choose DeFi? Decentralized finance generally offers users better rates and terms than traditional banks and brokerages. However, because it is the direct exchange of money and risk, risk is significantly higher in DeFi than in traditional finance. Transactions are generally irreversible and losses are permanent. Another reason to choose DeFi is because it's accessible from anywhere with an internet connection. Opportunities are global. The returns and yields of decentralized finance can be very high. This comes with the understanding that the money is not free. It comes with the acceptance of risk. Users of DeFi become the banks and brokerages, claiming the big risks and big rewards for themselves. We hope that you enjoyed this short explanation of what DeFi is. Please make sure you subscribe to our channel and check out our other educational videos. Thanks for watching. Bye for now.